Yo, 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 what's up, party people? Friday. It is Friday. Thank the Lord. I am ready for Friday like you can't even believe, man. Oh. <laughs> it's going to be a good show. I cannot wait. Just you guys being here. Hey, people are already chatting. I love it. John T. Good afternoon. Colorado. It is snowing in Colorado. That is insane. All right, I can't. Hold on, hold on. This is going crazy. All right. Ah, there it is. There we go. I was looking for the sound. There are five lights on this thing. And it's not the most precise tool in the world. <laughs> it is great to see you guys. We got a great show. We're going to do a lot of great things. We got lots to talk about as usual. Do you like my shiny vest? Man, do you feel the shiny? Shiny suit, man, baby. This is the gift of the one and only Mr. I can be Greg. Hey, my man. Good morning. Good morning. That's right. Uh, it's morning somewhere. You know, there are people. There are people in the world that just get up at this time of the day. This is it. They start their day like right now. Like, nah. people, uh, like people who work third shift. Or super awesome partiers. Oh yes. Which is going to be us. I'm going to try that Tuesday. out. Tuesday. So. Tuesday. We're going to go check out... Are you got enough room? Oh, yeah. Sorry, man. Oh, it's good. I'm kind of jacked against this corner. Yeah, over here. I, I'm better now. I'm Are better. Good? There, I'm there, good. there, there. There we go. Okay. Uh, it's a little dark. I don't know. Hold on. No, I'm good. Are you good? Yeah, Everything it's just good? washed out. It's good. Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, when we were doing this outdoors show, I, uh, I was like, oh, this is going to be great because outdoor lighting is awesome. Yeah. Except it's all on our back. It on our back, <laughs> which is the opposite of awesome. Uh -huh. So, and there's not enough like halogen in the world to light us up this way. I, well, I don't know what. If to people do. aren't blinded by your jacket, I'm not sure what yeah, they're gonna do man. anyway. I love my jacket. This jacket is a gift from the one and only Greg Haberman. See how he gave him a little. Oh, hold on. Wait. Why mm -hmm. doesn't that thing air? There. there. Yeah. I, I want to use the uh, sound effects more often. Blew that out. Yeah, I'm well, having trouble. Right. I can't. I have technical trouble, but at least it looks like the show is on. There are people here. We are going to be talking about how how to use your customers as your marketing department. Hmm. Kind of would depend on who your customers are, right? Or if they like you. <laughs> yes. Um. In fact, uh, there. That is a good. That's a good point. Well, let's just say I'm a. <laughs> let's just say I'm a prominent. A prominent business person. A prominent business person. Anybody I, in particular? Are you envisioning have, somebody in mind? I am, and I have particular, uh, <laughs> like Steve Ballmer. Let's just say I have like particular, like right wing, oh, evangelical oh, Christian belief. Yes. Right. True. Yeah. Okay. And, let's say that. Okay. Let's just say I'm like that person. Yeah, there's and a couple then, of those guys out there. And then out, you know, I'm not speaking about Chick-fil-A no, guy. Or no, no, I mean, you can pick a bunch of them. But uh, let's just say I go out at night and I pick up young male whores. Oh. I okay. probably would not want to use those customers as for my marketing. Which one, the male whores? <laughs> yeah. Unless they're evangelicals. That happens. Maybe. <laughs> um, I think those are called log cabin gays. Or well, something I, mean, like I just mean if you actually are... <laughs> You actually know, doing that paying for a it. lot of times that that segment of people look down upon mm, that's, um, that's male all I'm prostitution. Saying. Just it's, check yourself before you wreck yourself. It doesn't it doesn't I have nothing, <laughs> little, I have nothing no, against No, no, I'm all for it. Yeah, whatever. I mean, you want, everybody needs to have fun. They need to relax. Do what you gotta do. Um <laughs> oh, we get yeah. this show started yeah, on a get good it note. Out right. Yes. Yeah. You know what? I would I was just thinking uh, as I was 
pouring myself my cup of tea, my tea for the day. Mm -hmm. Like, I really wanted to talk about politics today. And I'm like, oh, it's not a political show. You know what, though? What? I'm not doing it. You're not even going to do it? No, I mean, well, you've been pressuring me all week to shave to a little Hitler mustache, and I'm not doing it. Are you sure? I'm sure. All right, Genghis Khan for you, then. standing... Well, how does Genghis Khan... Actually, I don't think you're too far off from Genghis Khan. If you could get that little pointy thing down here, a little pointy That usually takes me a while. That's gonna maybe you can get a fake one. Back in the nineties I thought it would be fun to grow the big pharaoh <laughs> box. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. My girlfriend at the time I, did not like that. Girlfriends. Always holding you back. Hey, look what I added. I added a little treat. I added a little treat Good. to our uh, let me show you guys. Well, you're there, but you get it. So here, um so when you know you guys are on this page, right? Here you are. Oh, here, sign up for the Sage Rock System 30-day free trial uh, for Friday Peeps. That's you guys. You are the Friday Peeps. Um, What'd you add? Gonna, oh, so here, like, so one of the things, one of the things that I like to do during my week is I like to gather, I like to gather um, news articles that I can share for the people on Friday. I'm like, oh, they might like to see that, or oh, I'm not like, but what is happening is I, I'm, I'm on all these different devices, man. I got like the phone, I got the tablet, I got, I'm on a PC down here, I'm on a, I'm on a Mac upstairs, I got, I'm a device man. Device man? And the problem with device man is I'm like, well, sometimes I save it on Feedly, sometimes I save it on Delicious, sometimes I save it as a bookmark, and I'm like, what could I do to Pull all those things together, and I had a, I came up with an idea. Google Reader. Idea. Google Reader. Ah, oh, those were the days. Nope, 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 nope. Delicious. Um, nope, I was trying that. Oh. The problem with delicious is that, like, uh, to add a book marklet on your phone is damn near impossible. I tried it. Okay. It was ridiculous. Don't okay. even bother. It's a waste of your time. It will just go insane. Okay. Um, Feedly was good, except, like, like it works good saving things. Feedly is an RSS reader. Actually, if you guys have never seen that, I should show it to you. Um, this is a good tool. Is it a good replacement for Google Reader? It is. Yes, it is. It is because Google Reader is dead. So here is Feedly. Have you, have you guys heard of Feedly? It's f e e d l y dot com, and it is an RSS reader. An RSS reader, it stands for really simple syndication, I think, right? That's yes. what I last I heard, right? And so what you do is you go down in here and you add content. Can you see? Wait, hold on. It's a little too high. Let me pull this down a little, a little. Okay. So I click this little add. You see over here on the left-hand side, add content. And you add, enter a URL. So I could enter, like, say, the Sagerock blog, sagerock.com slash blog. And you do this. And look, it comes up and it's like, oh yeah, content marketing. This could be, you know. And then they're like, could it be, could it be these things? Could it be any of these things? And um, maybe it's this one. I don't know. And then here, ah yeah. So this would be it. And then you like add to my Feedly. And then you can add like you can you can then it's all organized in here and you can come back. But you can do it on anything. You can do like um, like like okay, Drudge Report, right? So Drudge, so you can be like, you can come down here and you can be like, oh yeah, debt jumps three three hundred twenty eight billion in one day. Uh, Obamacare woes widen assured get wrong data. See, see, that's good. You can do CNN.com, but the, you might say, well, why would I want this? Why would I want this, Sage? And the reason you would want this is because it organizes all your stuff in one place. Oh, have you seen this thing, incidentally? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Darn it! Have you seen this running, walking, like, beast of a robot? I don't know where he went. Anyways, yeah, he was a picture of him. He was over here. Ah, never mind. Yeah, I was going to show you something, and then I clicked a button, and it didn't work. Whatever. But this is, okay, so there's a couple reasons this is good. One reason is it organizes your news. Okay. Like, for your industry. So okay. whatever your industry you're in, you can go in as long as they have like an RSS feed to it, which every major news publication does. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it's, you don't have to really worry about the RSS problem. That's one of the problems with RSS was it confused people. They're like, what is RSS and how come I have to learn it? You don't have to learn it. Just type in your URL over here now in the left-hand box, and if there's one, it'll pop up, and you click on it, and you're like, all right, I will take that. Um, you can also do, you can do, you can search by 
by like I clicked on news over here and they're gonna be like, oh well, do you like any of these people? Do you like CNN, ABC, Huffington Post, New York Times? Freaking liberal bastards! The whole thing's liberal bastards. That's weird. Anyways, that's weird, isn't it? Anyway, I, I drudge. I mean, I I I I I I, what? I do something else. Never mind. I I I <sighs> take two. You can put things in here. You can search by words. You can search by by URLs, and then you can organize all your stuff. And the amazing thing about this is that it it allows you to go through your news super quick, super quick. And uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna move this over here, so maybe I can click those things a little bit easier. There we go. So um, you know, like that, like that. So at any rate, this is Feedly. I recommend it uh, all for organizing all your information online. Do you use it? Do you use the Feedly? No. No. How do you organize your information? I don't. You don't. <laughs> You're um, one of these detail guys that like is, are you overwhelmed by information? You're like, oh man, if I was going to do this right, it would take me 10 hours to organize my Feedly. Yes. Yeah. So you're just like, screw that. Forget it. Who I has 10 know. hours? Yeah, nobody 10 has 10 hours. hours to do that. Right, right, right. <laughs> That's what I find interesting about you detail people. You're like really so conscientious that you can't like it's, you can't even organize it's sometimes. Stupid. It's well, stupid. Well, I don't hold you back. I mean, I'm a I'm a slob. I am like job of the hut of information. I'm like I like being late. <laughs> and then I'm like delicious. I just I go, you know. I'm just I'm just a, I I can't I I don't have a detailed bone in my body. So, I'm going to yeah. feebly attempt to get this back on oh, track. Oh, really? Oh, thank you. That's So, good. one of your problems yes. with all the delicious yes. Yes. and stuff like this was that yes. it, you were on so many different devices, yeah. a Mac, uh, uh, whatever. Does that uh, fix it? Does uh, Feedly fix it? No, no, Why it not? does not. Oh, it's greeting. Let's market, says Paula. Yeah, word. Let's market. I love it. That's a, that's a go go-to kind of attitude. Hey. Miriam says, greeting, chaps. Hey, Nimrod. That. Nimrod? <laughs> really? My name is Sage. <laughs> Does it? Okay, it helps organize, but it did not do everything I wanted it to do, and so what I did was I came up with this idea of using a hashtag, okay? And here's some marketing. Paula has inspired me. Good. Paula, so, I know. so what you will find in here is what I did was I have decided that I'm going to tweet out every article that I want to share with the, 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 the Friday peeps. Okay. You should get t-shirts. Friday peeps. And we should get t-shirts to say the tools on them. Oh, yeah. We have one, and then I left it upstairs. Me Marshall too. got shirts. Marshall provided the tools t-shirts. However, I forgot one, but I will be wearing it all week I next week at too. PubCon. PubCon, we're out there in Vegas. I have more on that in a minute. Okay. There's so much I want to tell these people. Ah, well, so, one uh, thing at a time. I know, I know. So at any rate, the tools, so so what I have done is every, now what I'm going to do is every time I um, want to share something with the, the Friday people, no matter what device I'm on, I'm going to tweet it out and I'm going to add the hashtag hash, which is a pound sign, the tools. And then no. what you'll, what? No way. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah, I totally am. And then what I did was, so let's take one step here. Do you know hashtags? Do you all know hashtags? I bet there's somebody out there that doesn't. Don't fear it. You don't have to be afraid. You can admit it. A hashtag is a way of organizing data. Or you can just, would you like me to just pull this over so you can lay back? A little? Would you like a recliner? No, I was just going to let you talk. Oh, would you like to talk? And, and yes, you, I'd like a recliner. <laughs> Next week. No, I got no, you're, one. You're, you're doing something. I was just going to let you do it. Oh, okay, okay, good. I'll chime good. in. Yeah, okay, good. All right, that's what. Yeah, you, you chill out. You want brother. me to talk what about oh. a hashtag is? Well, yeah. What is it? I don't know. Yeah, right. It's a way, it's, no, the way of organizing data. Ah, yes. So, like, what you can on do Twitter. is. Yes. And, and it, yes. And Facebook. And now on Facebook. And mm -hmm. Instagram. There you go. How about and Pinterest? Tumblr. Tumblr. Yeah, definitely Tumblr. And. And. I don't know, probably more. Uh, maybe, yeah. It's it's taking <laughs> over. over. Started it's, here, though. Yeah, it did. But if you notice, like, for example, over here on the left-hand side, I'm on Twitter right now, you can see that the United States trends. Um, pad ga iPad games is trending right now. And what you can do, that's a hashtag. And what's happening here is then by clicking on that, I am seeing all the posts that have the hashtag hash iPad games. No, you're not. No, I'm not. Why not? Because if you scroll up, yeah, you're actually looking at the top. 
oh, tweets. So but the most all, popular ones. Not, the ones. I'm not seeing all of them. Right. I'm seeing the top ones. Oh, how I wish there was a pen. I could circle that. Oh, but top. You can, but if you click on all. All now, now right. I will see it all. And the latest edition. Yeah. The people you follow will show you all the people that you follow mm. that are using that hashtag. That, that's is that brand new? Well, it's, I don't think it's brand new, but it's newer. Yeah, that's pretty hot. So there you yeah. go. All right, all right. So that's pretty cool. But this is an amazing way of searching for things. So like, let's. What if you search for the tools? There you go. Let's go. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do hash the tools. Okay. Hash the tools. Oh okay. My God. And here it is. Oh, look. Taiba Iram. Hi, Taiba. Friday Internet Marketing and the Tools. She used it. Very nice. Awesome. Very nice. Is it Taiba? That sounds nice. That's a nice name. It is. I don't Taiba. know if that's how you pronounce it, but it yeah. sounds nice. See, Taiba. If I'm uh, Taiba, if I'm saying that wrong, I'm so sorry. Not really my specialty, pronouncing things. You could retweet her. Oh, I would. Oh, okay. So what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to retweet her. So I'm going to retweet, and um. I can't. I. I. Uh, you know what? I just. You can't retweet with comments in here, can you? Not. Not without uh, a little work. I can't be working at the time like this. Oh, you it's gotta retweet it. So her. great. Oh, no reply. To see you. Okay, I'll do that. At. And then what I'm gonna do is the tools. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to put in the URL because. What will happen here is maybe other people will start following the tools, see? So now there's that, and I will retweet it and retweet. There we go. So there it is. There it is. And do you know what you just did? No, what? Spam the world? You used yeah. one of your customers, our viewers, ah, the client. Look what you're doing. To market. Ah, Taiba. You almost thought that wasn't a show. How did you do it? How <laughs> did you bring know. it in? It was accidental. It's like... It's like it's like we have a magic show, and we're like, I need a, a guest from the audience. Mm. Ty, young lady, what's your name? Oh, Taiba. Oh, Taiba, would you come upstairs? Let's give a hand for Taiba. Are you trying to tell no. me that she's no, a plant? No, no, no. I'm just saying that's what it felt like. Oh, yeah. But that's it. So, per perfect. But, oh, again, there's so much I want to talk to. But put a bin in that idea, Do people. It. Put a bin in that. So, if you have not used hashtags, I recommend it because it's an amazing way to search for things. You know, amazing. Um, but wait, there's more, and then I'm going to come back to this idea. But what I wanted to do was what I what what happened was when I searched for the when I when I the first thing I did was I researched the hashtag by searching for it because I'm like, what if that's all taken? And sure enough, there was some stuff. So like Haven's Kitchen has they're like talking about kitchen stuff, and they're like the tools, and then creatively yours. Uh, Point of view with a little help from travel, beer, time traveler, the tools. I don't even know what she's talking about. Yeah, who cares? I don't even know. I don't even know what she's talking about. But so, like, there were already some people that were using it, not excessively. If they were using it a ton, I would have switched to something else. Right. But what I wanted to do was, I wanted to make a place for all the Friday peeps. Look at that. Oh, and look what I just did. Oh, my God. Are you okay? Yeah, you don't worry about that. Oh, gee, many Christmas. So what I did is I now look look what I have here. Taiba is right here. She's right. I retweeted it, and now and we'll get back to this. I have helped promote Taiba, but just one thing at a time. Just one thing at a time. So am I saying that right? Anyways, I'll have to look in a minute. But wait, there's more. But how did I get it in there? You might ask. I don't know. One thing at a time. <laughs> how did I do that? Well. My friends, what I did was I searched for the tools on the Twitter. Okay. And then what did I do? I do not know. Oh, I do know. What do you click <laughs> that? What do you call that little thing? A you, wrench. A wrench. <laughs> Perfect. You a click the wrench. A it's a gear. <laughs> I know. I good. know it's a gear. You're doing good. Sometimes, actually, I do still have a. It's still a mental block for me. But what I did was. I'm going to go into advanced search. This is the only way I know to get to advanced search. Is I do a search in Google and Twitter for something, and then the search results come in, and then I get this gear, or wrench, whatever you really like. I feel you, and I click advanced search, and then I get this fancy. I guess you could go if you could remember it. 
twitter.com slash advanced hyphen, or search hyphen advanced. I, I can't be remembering things. And so I did this. I said I want to search on these hashtags, and I could do multiple ones, the tools. But then I said from these accounts, because I did not want the kitchen people in there. I didn't want the, the other point of view lady. I don't even know what she's heck's talking about. Yeah. So what I did was I put in my account, Sadrock. And I put in your account. Oh, thanks. Smo mash up. And then what no I did. No commas, no nothing. No, nope, I don't think so. And then I did. And there's all different kinds of things you can do. But so now what I've done is I said I've done an advanced search that's showing results for the tools from Sadrock or Smo mash up. And then what I did now, I go back to the gear. See there? And I embed this search. And what will come up is this fancy schmancy, and I can I can change the theme. I can change it from light to dark. I can change the height. I can show the top tweets, not the top tweets. I can auto expand uh, photos. I turned off safe search because <laughs> that would well, that work, right. <laughs> I mean that's no fun. And so and then what I did was here I did I, I'm going to do light. I clicked create widget. And the widget is down in here. This is the tech. This is the the code right here. I just copied this, and then I added it to our page over here. In the HTML. And the HTML. So you have to have a little bit of HTML experience, uh, capability. It's not hard. Not too hard. I mean, so I got to say, you should be able to edit uh, to be able to do this. I would think you would probably need HTML experience and FTP experience. If you have uh, WordPress, WordPress and your site uses uh, widgets like in the yeah, sidebar, maybe. then usually there's just a generic HTML text box widget mm, and you could, put that right you could in there. take that little code that they give you, paste yes. it in there and save it and it'll do the same thing. And then, voila! This. Now what's interesting about this advanced search that you did to yeah. create this yeah. was that not only are you getting rid of all the potential um, spam yeah. or, or unrelated or things unrelated. because yeah. it's only from your account or my account, yeah. um, but in order for someone else's tweets, like Taiba's, to be in here, yes. you have to retweet her. So she can't she just not, mention the tools right. and do it. Now, I could I could have opened it to anybody. Right. And I might, maybe. We'll, well just see. Yeah, I just mean, uh, I think a lot of people get concerned about, like, well, if I just mm. embed this, then someone can hijack that things. and they'll say mean things. Or... Oh, so that's really interesting because that does, like, you'll I, I hear that all the time. Mm -hmm. like, like, a big brand will be like, we'll be streaming live this hashtag. Right. And then that's just perfect for you to go and say crazy crap. Right, exactly. But with and this... I recommend doing oh, that. Oh, yeah, that's, that's way fun. fun. That's way fun. Like, if you can get your crazy crap, like, on the, uh, uh, in Times Square, because mm -hmm. it happens. Like, mm -hmm. Domino's Pizza is always doing that. In mm -hmm. Times Square, they, they end up having insane things mm -hmm. scrolling on Times Square, which is good. It's a good time. It's a good time. But, uh, but this does help you. And so, but... Anybody that retweets like the tools, you know, anybody that's doing that, I'll just come over and I'll, I'll retweet you. Yeah. You know, I'll and come now you know, like, it. if you do want it, you can actually embed um, something like that on a on your site. Yeah. And what happens? Uh, what What'll happen then if you don't restrict it by account? Is yeah. that you open it up and it turns more into a live streaming like chat functionality. Yeah, that's that's right. Now it can be from other people. Sure. You know what I mean? Sure. Other people could get in on that where you might yeah. not want them in the conversation. Well, the but other, you can do that. But one of the cool things about it is let's say you're doing a live <laughs> so so there are things called uh, Twitter chats, okay? And I'm going to I'm going to go back out here and I'm going to wait, let me go, let me show you here. So I'm going to go back and do a search and I'm going to do advanced search. So what you can do is, I mean, you can, you could, let's say you're having, let's say you're having a, um, a Twitter chat, and, and, and a Twitter chat is just, it's, it's a live thing where, where a group of people are generally around a hashtag, and um, they, they all, you know, and, 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 you can, and you can just follow that hashtag. Mm -hmm. But let's say, for example, you wanted the chat to be, from maybe a core group of people. Mm -hmm. I mean, you could put five people's addresses in mm -hmm. here, 
And so you could really do some pretty pretty cool stuff. You can even do it geographically. Mm -hmm. So you could be like, well, they have to be in New York City, you mm -hmm. know. Um, you can, and I don't know how the heck they do this, but apparently you can select positive or negative or questions. I think they use those things. Like if the smiley face oh, is included in oh, the tweet, oh, then they'll use only those. Oh, you know? clever. I see, I see. Um, so tons of really cool things you can do with this. Um, that is, you know, I just it's, it's, it's a great way to search, but it's, it also is a great way to add additional content. And so here again, like if you notice, Taiba, um, she posted again, and see there, and I'm retweeting her mm -hmm. because Taiba is awesome. Mm -hmm. And and well, you know what else I'm going to do? I'm going to go over and I'm going to check out Taiba. Hold on. I'm going to come over here and I am going to follow her. She is an HR professional consultant, lead auditor, Rotarian. Social media marketing is my passion, networker, love to read. She sounds fun. I like her. Indeed. And so here's, here's where the show goes. Here we go, down the rabbit hole of why you all are here for the exciting moment. Oh, what? is it because I just put my hood on? That's nice. Can my, I do that too? my first time this year. I know. Well, you know, I wanted to point that out. Our outdoor show is a little bit chilly this week. Yeah. It's not too bad. No. You know, I'm ready for uh, a forest fire now. <laughs> Bring it on, forest fire. I will be safe. Because this stuff is a shield, man. It is a shield. Zip me up. Oh, yeah. Well, now look, you're one of those forest fire guys. Didn't that, did it look like this? Huh? Did they look like this? These shields? Your oh, fire? like the baked potato suit? Was it a baked potato the suit? The last ditch option? Yeah, it was pretty much kind of similar. <laughs> you told me that whole story. He, my man Greg over here, uh, National Park Forest Park Ranger Man Parker. What, <laughs> Forest Park or, Ranger Man Parker? I don't know. What were you guys called? Uh, park Ranger. Park Ranger. <laughs> or otherwise known as a park ranger in the National Forest. And you were on fire duty, right? Well... Actually, those are two separate careers. Oh, they were. I was, a, I was a forest firefighter for the National Forest Service and oh. a park ranger for the U.S. And how the park hell system. did you end up here? What the hell? And man? now I like computers. <laughs> you were such on an interesting path. Thank you. <laughs> and now I'm you're random. forced to sit here with Baked Potato Man. Keywords: <laughs> <and> Baked <laughs> Potato Man. But you told an amazing story that like that you firefighters had this outfit. And what happened when you put this outfit on? Oh, you, you baked like a baked potato. <laughs> they gave this to you like when when in the nuclear holocaust when they told the kids to get under their desk. Yeah. Right? Okay. So I can tell real quick. Okay, tell it. So, really it's worth it. So if you're fighting out in the forest, you you have this giant backpack. It's about like 45, 50 pounds okay. that you have to wear at all times, unless you uh, like your supplies. You know, there's it's there. life. Yeah. yeah. And. Uh, and you know if you carry your tools on it, blah 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 blah. Yeah. Um, unless you're carrying a water pack, but whatever. Okay. Um, so one of the things, the most important thing that you have in your backpack as a firefighter is yeah. um, what we all called baked potato <laughs> of death. <laughs> Did it look a lot like and this? it was literally a big sheet of what was almost <laughs> aluminum foil, and it was just a, a rectangle, and you would grab it at its corners and step on the other two corners. Oh my gosh. And it was like if the fire was coming towards you yes. and you were surrounded, there was no way out. Yeah. You were to grab it, lay on the ground, curl Pull up in the and... fetal position, bake like a potato, and, and basically <laughs> die. die while the fire comes across you. But it gave you something to feel like you were doing. You could kiss your ass goodbye in private. <laughs> So, I've seen those things. Yes, it's scary. Um, yeah, and, but that, uh, yeah, I'm not that, convinced that, that, that they were. That confused me to no end. That story. Uh, not but uh, at were. any rate, yeah, I, I think I think society gives us those things. The baked potato suits, like here. Oh, here like I, the oxygen and uh, airplanes. Oh yeah, yeah. oxygen and airplane. Yeah. You know you're done when that yeah. shit blows up. <laughs> it's over, man. Suck it's it and over. smile. You know, I just saw World War Z with uh, Tom Hanks. I mean, Bill <laughs> Cruz. Tom Cruise. What's that guy's name? Brad Pitt. Brad Pitt. <laughs> there. If I put enough two words together, I will come up with it. With Brad Pitt, uh -huh. he blew up a hole in the airplane. Everybody went, ran out. I mean, it fell out of the hole. He blew yeah. it up with a with a grenade. Yeah. And he he didn't. And the things fell down. Yeah. He didn't even put them on. <laughs> he didn't put it on. I just thought it was so funny. Like they made kind of a point of it. Like it fell down. Yeah. And he's like, screw that. Well, yeah, he must, we're, we're you know what? We're he screwed. must have watched Fight Club. <laughs> That's true. That's true. Probably. It was another scene. Um, so at any rate, Taiba. Taiba here. 
um, retweeted this. Very nice. And so what is happening here is... I don't know what is happening here. What are we talking about? Well, what we're talking about today, believe it or not, is how to use your customers as marketers. Hmm. Now, something that I've heard happens in businesses. It doesn't oftentimes happen in our business. I don't really know why. But I have heard, rumor has it, that people oftentimes get business from referrals. It does mm. happen in our business yeah. occasionally, for sure. For sure. Yes. Um, but I've talked to many people that say that's how all their business comes. Mm -hmm. That we would not survive <laughs> with all that. You know, so that's why we have this exciting show. Oh, so, thrilling. So that's, I mean, it is a well-known fact that referrals get people business. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> but what I find happens is, what I, okay, so what I notice out there in the, in the world, in the business world, is that people are going along, they're doing things, they're doing, they're networking, they're getting referrals, they're, they're, they're being human beings, and then you say to them, Facebook? And they're like, buy my stuff. <laughs> That's it. I mean, they're like, if I'm going to be on Facebook, buy my stuff. Oh, you mean like they're, they're like normal, everyday they're like normal, human beings. They're like regular human beings. Communicating. Yeah, they're like telling mean, stories. They're fun. And then when they go on the social media, they're, they turn into advertisers. Buy my stuff. <laughs> buy it now. I got my stuff. Here's a here's an iStock photo. Buy it. You know what doesn't huh. happen? Huh. People don't usually buy that like that. No, it sucks. It sucks. So like. So what would be a better way? Like what Taiba here has done. You see? So here's the thing. So Taiba has... I've got to go down and see if that's how... I'm pro she's probably like, no, Sage, if you say it one more time like that, I'm going to just jump off a cliff. Okay, where are all the... Where are they? Where'd they go? I don't know. Uh, I lost all my, all my stuff. Okay. Ah, look at that. My dad says, where the hell is all the crap? Back to the newest. Huh? There. Oh, thanks. Look at there. My dad, John T, says, I'm continually impressed with Greg. I always wanted to be a forest ranger. Yeah, he's a badass dude, this guy. Thanks. Yes. So, okay, Taiba hasn't written to, to chastise me on the incorrectness of her name. So I'm just going to keep saying it that way, Taiba. So, um, so Taiba here has, she has the understanding of how to use a hashtag. And I would imagine she probably knew before the show, you know. Mm -hmm. And so what she did was she found that like she she used the tools hashtag I noticed it and by her promoting us I promoted her yes so like and that's what happens okay so these it's usually guys okay but what I gotta say is women tend to get this more than men I would say well, I know that's usual. a stereotypical What's thing usual, guys? okay Guys, talk are the to ones... me about bro culture. Okay, bro. Okay, bro. <laughs> what I'll tell you is, guys don't get social media. As a, as a, since I'm a guy, I can, I can define them stereotypically like that. They don't like, they're, they're, they're the people when I'm in a, doing a social media class that raise their hand. And they're like, this stuff is a waste of time. I don't use it. I don't know why anybody else is using. It. Anybody else is using it. stupid. Mm -hmm. and I'm like. I'm so glad you're going to spend the next eight hours with me because this is going to be fun. So, and anyways, I mean, it happens all the time. It still happens today. Um, and in fact, the more middle you get to the country, the more it happens. There are there are definitely places in the middle of America right now that are like, they they can't imagine using social media mm -hmm. um, for business. And then I got to say, you go over to Europe, you go to um, Korea, not Korea, South Korea is pretty. They're awesome. But you go to like China, Japan, mm -hmm. those people are way conservative and they're like, whoa, 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 man. My boss did not tell me I could say that, so I will not be saying that stuff. Mm -hmm. But what I'm here to tell you is that they they do it normally. Okay? Mm -hmm. You go out, okay, you go out with a Japanese businessman. You are guaranteed for a fun time. You are first gonna stop off at a buffet. They love buffets. Then you're going to go have some karaoke. And then you're probably going to go to a gentleman's club. They are the funnest people you've ever met. Did you just watch like Lost in Translation again? I have been out with them. <laughs> I have been out with them. They're still smoking. They're like party animals. All right.
They're party animals. Mm -hmm. But you, and they do that on business trips. That's what they do. They come over here, they schmooze you. You're like, oh my God, these are the coolest people I've ever met in the world. But yet, then you put them on the Facebook, and they're like, wow. Jeez, man, I can't be telling people about stuff. And I'm like, but just last night, you, you, did you see what you were doing last night? You're like, well, that's different. Mm -hmm. I'm like, how is that different? If anything, doing something on Facebook is much more sane and 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 civilized. We were like animals last night. Oh, we're going to Vegas. We should hook up with some Japanese businessmen. We're going there next week. Hey, we're going to be at PubCon next week. I got to say, that's going to be the intermission. We're going to talk about PubCon. We real quick, little real logo. quick, real quick. We're going to be at PubCon next week. Uh, you know what you should do? What? You should go find that uh, tweet, the PubCon tweet. The PubCon tweet. And I should retweet it. Well, it's already there. Right now? You should show them because what they oh. are doing is you're using another. Oh, it, like we can make that work? Yes. Okay, how do I do that? Do you know? <laughs> how do I get to the Twitters? <laughs> Holy crap, you're really I'm putting sorry. me on the spot here, buddy. <laughs> <not trying> <laughs> Holy crap. Scroll down. Uh, are you Scroll sure? Down. Yep, yep, yep. Keep going, keep going. Go, 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 go. I spam Twitter here in a lot. You'll see it. Really? Oh, you really did. There ah! we go. Thank you. There go. And then what do I want to do? Retweet it? Oh, well, I, just I was did. just saying it's already there. But, oh. But so. Oh, thank you. What we okay. have here is next week. Next week. Sage and I yes. are going to Las Vegas. Las Vegas. And we're going to be. Part of PubCon. Yeah. Which is, this is going to be their largest conference ever. Ever. Yeah. And that's so that's exciting. We're going to be doing Sorry, the show. Yes. We're going to be doing it on uh, Monday. Monday at 6 p.m. At 6 p.m. Las Vegas time. Las Vegas time. What is that West Coast? I don't know. I don't know. Like two, and we're going to be doing it for a couple hours. Yeah, some six to eight, and it's going and to be right here at sagerock.com slash live. Yeah. So you guys can tune in. Tune yeah. in for free. We're, we're going to be... do interviews with a bunch of like speakers, yeah. so you'll get like a glimpse yeah. behind the scenes for free. And I'm going to try and convince them to give away things to speakers. Nice. That's going to be my thing. I'm going to be like, what do you have to give away to our awesome? Audience. Nice. And so Sage is going to be presenting there. He's going yeah. to be doing a book signing. Book if you're signing. in Vegas, come by, man. Come by. I would love um, that. Get tickets. I don't know yeah. if they're still available or not. I don't know. But you could find out. And I think we're going to broadcast other times too. Yeah, but, but just stay tuned. We don't know if that's going to be live or not. But so. however, the way to find out is to follow either me in general on Twitter or the hashtag the tools. There you go. Or just come back to sagerock.com slash live. So, so we're going to be doing this. That's going to yeah. be helping them out. It's an yeah. attraction for them. See there. And uh, what they did here, what, doing. what they did here is they came over on Twitter and they're like, hey, check out the tools. Yeah. They're going to be here at PubCon next week. So they have this big like list of following all these conference yeah. people that follow them. Like, click on PubCon. Okay. Their name. Probably like five people. <laughs> no. Well, so they have like 6,500 6, People, targeted people follow them. Yes. And so they tweeted that, Look you know, that. to come check us out. That was our last, their last tweet. Yeah, and so us. I think that's pretty awesome. It's so sweet. And so it's like a give and a get, you yes. know, like everybody's helping each other out. Yeah. And, and by doing that, like, people are more likely yeah. to help you out if yeah. you're helping them out. And do you know what and I Social found? media is perfect. So what I what we did here was we went to PubCon. We went to these people. I'd spoken down in uh, New Orleans. And I went to their uh, editing uh, director, and I said, hey, man, I would love to do the tool show in Vegas. Mm -hmm. And then we talked to Brett Tabke, the, mm -hmm. the guy who does, does the show, and he's like, look, man, as long as I don't have to do anything, it's cool with me. Mm -hmm. And the thing about it is it doesn't cost them a dime. No. They didn't have – I mean, they're – they don't have to pay us for even lunch. They don't do lunch. I mean, nothing. They don't not not, not a flight, not a nothing. They did oh. say they were going to give us some free drinks. Oh, really? That'll be great because I don't drink. <laughs> but I can drink a hell of a lot of diet coke. So there good. Go. Okay, I'll I'll pound some diet coke. I can do that. Keep myself a headache. But whatever. But at any rate, we did that. And so, it's a symbiosis. It's a symbiotic. It's a kumbaya. It's a geo cash. It's a geo. I don't know. It's a working together. Yeah, you were, it's a you were there, and then you yeah. just went off. But what I found is the way this stuff works is you have to give first. Yeah. You know what? Like Taiba. You know what's not hard? What? Doing that. No, it's not hard at all. Especially online. And people are, yeah. It's not hard to like be like, hey, you know who's cool, Taiba? And you know why she's cool? Because she looks cool. And she was super nice. 
I just you get a sense of how kind of a nice person she is right out of the gate mm -hmm. because she mm -hmm. did that. Mm -hmm. And like and 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 now I'm thinking of all the ways I can help Taiba. Mm -hmm. Like I got to go back now. I'm gonna, now I got to go think. Well, you know, I think it's actually really cool. Taiba. Like Twitter is a great platform for this too yeah. because it's real time. Yeah. And so one of the things like there are a, a few years ago I was working on a piece of code for a website and I was having a little trouble with this program and so I went online you know I went to this forum and I went to Twitter and yeah. you know to go try and figure this out yeah. and I found some guy and this guy was having the same problem that I was yeah and so I found him on Twitter yeah and we just started talking about our problem together on Twitter and yeah. then we helped each other fix it yeah. And this is a complete random stranger, and you know we're still pals on Twitter. Yeah, and so it's pretty cool, you know. I mean, but just by helping each other out, you know. Yeah, check this out. Taiba is from Pakistan. Okay, isn't okay. that now? Here's this is blowing my mind, right? Mm -hmm. So Taiba, mm -hmm. what time do you think it is in Pakistan? I don't know. Probably like three p.m. It's probably like twenty-four hours. Is she right? still in Pakistan? Well, I don't know. She said she's in Lahore, Pakistan. Oh. I, I don't guess. know. I don't know. I know. Um, look at that. And she writes, I am born to live, not to exist. That's nice. I got a kindred spirit with this Taiba. Mm -hmm. I think she's awesome. And so, but check this out. So it's not even like, you know, Taiba lives way far away, way far away, but we have this in common. And like, and, and so the thing about it is, Taiba is a social media enthusiast. Maybe she's doing social media marketing for, this is her About Me page, mm -hmm. and I'm going to tweet it mm -hmm. out, okay? And so the thing about it is, is, like, we have this in common. She's in, but she's in Pakistan. We're in Akron, Ohio, mm -hmm. you know? But we can work together, and we can help each other. Mm -hmm. And who doesn't want to help each other? I love it. I love it. I'm tweeting this. Haters. Haters. Haters don't white want to help men. each other. Old white men. That's no, who. because you seem interested in this. Yeah, <laughs> I don't like my kind. Uh, all right, I don't know what to say. I gotta, I'm got going to find something to say. I'll think about it, but I am going to... Uh, oh, look at here. Look what I can do. Look, I can click this. I can click this share button, I think. Yeah. And I can do the Twitter. And what did I do wrong? Oh, I did nothing wrong. It came over here. Hold on. And look here. I just found Taiba on about.me. Check it out. And then I'll say she's an awesome fan of the tools. Okay. So now. So check it. Check it. Check it. Check it. So now I do that. I click the tweet. You know what's funny? What? This will be the last day she likes social media. She's going to be like, like, those tools, oh, put, put oh, my picture up everywhere. There are two white boys from Akron, Ohio stalking me. I don't feel safe anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really concerned. So, yeah, yeah, right on. Exactly. I'm like, how can I help Taiba? So, at any rate, so there is that. Um, oh, a new comment. Hooray. Oh, relationship building. Yes, yes. We are all in this together, people. Um, our politicians would not agree. They would like us to believe that we should all hate each other about 50-50. But that is bullcrap. We need to stick together. And I believe, I believe in the saying that a rising tide, a rising tide lifts all boats, which means, you know... Science, yo. Science. Look it up. It's science. It's science. Um, you don't understand how a boat floats. Why are you watching our no. show? But what I don't get about it is, I, okay, I really don't get it. That saying, I say it sometimes, but like somebody has to rise the tide, right? Doesn't somebody have to be the water? Because who do you know that's ever been water? Okay, what I'm saying Maybe is if I'm, a boat, if I'm a boat... Bruce Lee would kick the shit out of your boat. If I'm a boat, I have no control over the water. If No matter how much I pee in that water, I am not going to lift or yeah, what. Why do you keep peeing in the I'm swimming pool? I'm just imagining pool. how I can help lift the tide. Well, not by that. Well, It's I, not enough. I just don't feel it doesn't matter like, how much Diet Coke you drank. I just don't feel like <laughs> that saying it gives me much control. Then why... Like, why are you? I don't know. I don't know how I can help people with the rising tide lifts all boats. Like, yeah, okay, yeah. Like, let's go find a rising tide, everybody. 
I don't know. I want to be something else. I want to be like a um, waterbed. No. Yeah. I okay. Be great. A lock. I want to be a lock. You want to be a waterbed. A rising, a rising lock lifts all the boats that are in the lock, and I could be a lock. Like lock. And every lock I've ever seen has just been to cook like rice and noodles no, in. Not a lock. Like a, stir a fry. lock. A lock, man. All right, we gotta go. All right, I've had enough. Have you had enough? I'm done Does with anybody, this week. anybody? Okay, yeah. Word, baby. <laughs> word, baby. Um, look at there. There's Taiba. Okay, let me double check any news that I wanted to tell people. Oh, oh, oh. You posted all this news up and didn't talk about it at all. I know, I know. Well, people can come back and look at it oh, if they want. True. Um, Twitter announces scheduled tweets. Here, I'll show you. I'm not going to go there. Okay, yeah. Let's just do a quick in the news. Um, the scout announces scheduled tweets, but you have to be in the Twitter uh, ad program. So you can only schedule tweets if, tweets if you have the ads. All right, let's rate that. Uh, as far lame, as news goes. Not news. Yeah, lame. But at least, it, well, it's news and that it is new. Yeah, but you could... It's more like new. Yeah, new. Here's something in the new. new. Right, but it's not, <laughs> not news. Not news. Yeah. It would have to be two things. Yeah, and that's not it. would have to be it. two news. You know, I got two news. others. What? If they if people are interested in that but don't want to sign up for Twitter ads. Yeah, yeah. Buffer or Hootsuite. Yeah, that, yeah definitely. So there you that's, go. Yeah, Three that. alternatives. Don't, yeah, don't, don't. Yeah. All right, next. Um, really good article here on uh, should I hire an in-house developer outsourced overseas? Do you want to give me this? Do you want me to give you the spoiler? Uh, spoiler. Can you imagine? What's the spoiler? Blend. Oh, there perfect. It is. Okay. Yeah. I read about a thousand words to get to do mix it up. <laughs> do you ever check at the bottom of those long I articles should, I should. for the I should. I was too just long waiting. didn't read? It was just yeah. Um, how to build a successful company without a product? This article I really liked. Um, because it gave this idea of before going to all the trouble of building a product and maybe nobody buying it. That's how they opened this. This was a really good opening. They were like, Have you, the biggest thing that people do is they build a product and then nobody comes to it. These people said, you know what you should do? Why don't you build a blog and see if people are interested in it? Mm. I thought that was pretty good. Yeah, cool. And then the cool thing about it is what would happen is um, you um, – then would build a like a, an audience, and you'd be like, "Hey, I'm building this blog to see if there's any interest in this tool." And then when you launch the tool, and then and then everybody that swore they would buy it didn't buy it, you can like yell at them. Well, so you know that's kind nice. of the that's kind of where the Kickstarter model comes from, right? Mm, where you're basically like, interest. "I have this idea. Yeah, is this worth anything to you? How much is it worth to you? And yeah. how much interest is out there? Yeah, 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 and yeah. then you get funding, or funding. you don't. Yeah, right on. And if you don't, you didn't waste your money. Yeah. Uh, here's another article that is really just a headline. The secret to Google AdWords, video ads. Perfect. Basically, they didn't tell you how to do it. Who Nothing. Cares, but, but do it. it. But do that's it. good. Okay. Uh, 58 resources to help you learn master SEO. This is actually a little bit older of an article, but really good. Okay. Um, I thought they, I mean, tons of stuff. I don't mm -hmm. know, like, you might actually There's drown a lot in of all stuff that, in here. but it's really good. You couldn't yeah, drown if you had a boat and the tide was rising. Word, baby. Uh, crossing the digital divide. This is a good infographic on like uh, th these Click people. It. Okay, yeah, you should. It's worth seeing. Um, this article did a nice job of talking about how 2013. It says so. Yeah, let me blow her up. Blow that baby up. Okay. Yeah, it's worth seeing. Thanks. Um, We've seen this coming for quite some time, but now we're here. 2013 marks the first year U.S. adults spent more time viewing media on digital devices more than any other form. Mm. That's huge. Mm -hmm. This is. It appears that print, radio, and even television have officially become unseated as dominant sources of media. So then they just talk about like you know they're like they're showing you all the data. So what's great about this article actually is the fact that um, if you're having people that like so Taiba for example, let's say she's trying to convince people um, in Pakistan to get on social media, mm -hmm. and they're like nobody uses social media, you know. She could pull out this article and be like, uh, actually, nobody uses that TV anymore. Mm -hmm. We're all like over there on the Netflix and the Hulu and the YouTubes, you know. Mm -hmm. um, so let me see. So you can see, look at this. Look at this. Look how it's like leveling off like TV. If you notice, like digital, look, it goes up. I, I see. Mm -hmm. That's what I love about graphs. Up. Uh, sort of downish. Radio down. Print. Oh, ouch, ouch, if I was a print. A comparison channel, then look at that. The one that goes up, only one. There you go. Uh, anything else? Growth of mobile, look at that. Ah, tablets, look at that. Feature phones. The feature phone is the one, I love how they call it, that's the one that has numbers on it. <laughs> it's going down. Yeah. Uh, comparison of other digital devices. Uh, smartphones, they go up. 
Okay. Uh, that's it. That's it. Yeah, yeah. So that, I like that article. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Um, oh, becoming a media company: how to turn your business into a platform. So this is kind of an interesting article. It's something I'm kind of into myself personally. The fact of you know if you become a publisher, how you can basically own your audience, and that's kind of what we're doing here. And then I started another blog. Um, are you? Is gravity affecting you poorly or something? Are you okay? Yeah, I went and saw that movie. Gravity. Yeah, is it messing with your head? No, I feel you all in, swimmy. Yeah, you saw it in 3D, man. That's too much. That's too much. It was too much for me just to see it in 2D. Um, so that's kind of interesting. Um, Google's not provided at 87% of Google search traffic to major news sites. So not provided means they're not showing uh, key phrases anymore. I thought this was a surprise. Oh, I'm not showing you any of this stuff. Here, look, I thought this was a surprise. AOL overtakes Google for the most video ads served. I thought that was interesting. They're serving more ads over at AOL. Uh, more brands are using real-time bidding. That's I got it. That's a whole site its, or time in itself. Real-time bidding. Oh is God, cool. how many of these are There's there? So many important things. The existential tension between content marketing and advertising. Kind of lame. I'd kind of skip that. Uh, really brought nothing to the conversation. Twitter aims to sell ads on other sites. Uh, that's So Twitter might be more than just Twitter. It might be an ad network. All right, that's enough. Um, marketing, do it. That's what that's that's what I wanted to tell you all. Yeah, that's good. Um, I believe in that. One more, time. One more time. Does anybody have do anything they're going to do? Awesome. What's oh, how's the temperature in Pakistan? I bet it's a lot like Ohio. I do not know. Anything going on in Pakistan I should know about? Why is this? I don't know. This is <clears throat> messing with me. Okay. Oh, good. Uh, John T. Our PR guy said he didn't care if they talked bad about us. So. Just so they talked about us, yeah. You know that's sort of interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, all publicity is good publicity. You tend to disagree with that. I tend to be more on the side that I do agree. But I will say this: I have gotten to the point now in my life where it's too stressful. It can be stressful. I, yeah. I don't dig okay, it. I don't dig they, it. They, all that water getting to you. Slow down on that stuff. <laughs> Kind of yeah, well, there you go. That's the sign right there. Practice it. Um, let me see here. So, yeah. I think that is the. I think that's the long and short of it. Anything else? You doing anything good this weekend? I am pack, going to Vegas, packing baby. and going to Vegas. See us in Vegas. It's going to be fun. Should I wear this shirt all? I think I'm going to wear you this. Can do the whole whatever time. you want. Right. Monday. Monday, six o'clock. Six o'clock p.m. Time. in Vegas I'm gonna time. going to say that's what do they call that? Pacific time. Vegas time. Just Vegas time, baby. And then we're going to the club. We're so going to see Diplo. What stays there doesn't have no, to stay No, because we're going to tape the crap out of that, and then we're going to do it live, and then we're going to cut it up and put it on YouTube for all eternity, which is going to be great. I love it. All right, everybody. I hope you have a great weekend. Do something awesome because you are awesome. And without further ado, play us out, Keyboard Cat. All right, Keyboard Cat says, see ya.